Let's take a look at the Android gallery, which is different compared to older Nexus to older Android handsets running Android 1.5 and 1.6. I believe Droid has different uh, gallery as well. So to access gallery, you have you can open your app catalog and you can find the gallery on there. Mine is already on the home screen over here, which I can place anywhere I like. You click it. And it takes us to gallery. Uh, have to go back. It takes us to gallery, and you can see all of our folders. I have camera shots, download, shoot me, and video. The on the the button on the top right corner will open the camera. This gallery works with the accelerometer. As you rotate it, I'm not sure if you can see it kind of rotates the pictures. You can do landscape and you can see a little bit as you rotate the phone kind of moves with it which is quite cool. So we can click on the downloads for example which will open all the pictures I have on there. I can use the scroll bar to scroll through dates. It sorts them by date once again landscape. Now on top you see which folder you are in right now. You can press this button to go back to the folder above. You also have multi-touch support. So once again landscape. Once you open the picture you can click on it to see more information and you can go back to the downloads folder or go back to the very first folder. So once you can, you can kind of just swipe to look through your pictures. You can use multi-touch, pinch and zoom. You can move picture around a little bit when you zoomed in. You can press back to zoom out and back again to go back. This also handles video. Like right now I have one video in my collection which is, well, yeah, this is downloaded video folder. This is an episode of a TV show, so you can click on that and I can watch it. This video is encoded at 800 by 480, which is the phone resolution, and it looks beautiful. Now let's go back. Now, under my camera shots, it groups video and audio and, uh, and pictures. So, for example, you can see this little play looking thing on the thumbnail which stands for video so if I click on that it will open my recorded videos and now I can watch that let's go back again and on top you have a switch which allows you to sort pictures by date kind of or just view all of them and once again the scroll bar on the bottom allows you to 